hii wiki tumeshuhudia shule kule Mnyasi akuza mwalimu mkuu mpio ya ajabu hilo jambo limenihuzunisha sana it is very very saddening na nataka tuangalie baadhi ya maswala ama effects za kufanya hivyo it is so bad maybe kama ujaona hiyo video nataka uangalie tukiendelea to so bad kufukuza mwalimu mkuu kwenye shule mbele ya wanafunzi wazazi wameungana boda boda na wanafunzi kufukuza mwalimu mkuu that was so bad iliwahi fanyika shule jirani kule kwetu nikiwa mdogo but amini asiamini nimemaliza hadi chuo kikuu nafanya kazi lakini shule hiyo haikuwa ipata matokeo bora kuliko yale ambayo yalitolewa na huyo mwalimu ambaye alifukuzwa this was the saddest moment in the history of Kenya's education matokeo yanachangiwa na pande zote si walimu si wazazi si wanafunzi si serikali lakini mkishurutisha mwalimu mkuu peke yake kutoa matokeo hiyo haitakuwa sawa na hiyo maneno yalisapotiwa ama yalipangwa na mbunge sababu angalia jinsi boda boda walivyojitokeza kwa wingi hadi na matawi to so bad Mungu arehemu hiyo shule na ingekuwa vizuri kabla huyo mwalimu mkuu ajaaga ama ajafariki waende wamuombe msamaha as early as this otherwise i'm telling you for free a time is coming watatafuta matokeo they will look for those results they will use all means but it will be in the main it won't work just look this was unceremonious ni kama walitoa mwalimu mguo ni kama walimfanya awe uchi and among the people who are pushing huyo mwalimu i doubt if some of them have gone beyond class 1 so i don't think if a scholar can behave the way majority of those parents majority of those border borders uh, in fact i'm very annoyed na huyo mwenye alisukuma shika mwalimu kushingoni na kusukuma kabisa kama mrokeni that's very bad It's my hope and prayer that this one will never occur again in the history of this republic. 